Hi, this is Kara from Darling Vulgarity. So I cracked, I did it. I bought a couple of pieces from the Doen Gap collaboration. I wasn't sure about this collaboration, but I thought I would give it a shot. By the time I decided I was gonna give it a shot though, a lot of things were sold out. Apparently, a lot of Doen fans were less conflicted than me about the collab. I did end up getting the floral midi dress. I decided I wanted to size up in the dress. I'm normally a US size 14. I got the largest size they had, which was a 16. And now that I have it on, I'm really glad that I did. It is definitely fitted. The fabric doesn't have a whole lot of stretch. It is a slip dress, which I like the style, but the style isn't always like me. All that being said, I really like this. I think it fits nice. I was a little worried that it was going to be see-through, but it is lined. So you can choose whether or not to wear a slip with it. I chose not to since it's lined already and I feel fine. There's a zip up the side, but honestly, I was able to just pull it on right over my head. And there's a tie at the back so that you can accentuate the waist a bit. It has flutter sleeves. I'll show you a close up of the neckline because it does have some really nice details. So there's the bow in the middle and kind of baby blue piping around the V-neck. And the print is just very, very pretty. It's a nice floral with pops of primary colors. I get a very 1940s feel from this dress, which I love. And the dress itself, I would say, is a true white. It's not a bright white, kind of a warm white. The materials are rayon, miscus, and polyester. If you are someone who really needs natural materials and the things you wear, I would not recommend this. But again, it's a very comfortable dress. I feel like it's very classic looking. I'm not sure, honestly, how doughin it feels to me, but I do like the dress. So I'm glad I took a chance and got it. I'm sure I'll find lots of occasions to wear it this spring and summer. The fabric is such that I can wash it at home. So if my three-year-old spills popsicle all over my lap, uh, then no big deal. It's not a really expensive doughin dress. It's just a dress from the Gap. All in all, a nice basic, a nice easy summer dress. I would just recommend sizing up. Okay, these pants just came in the mail, uh, so they are quite wrinkled. Uh, I got a size 14, and as you can see, they are too tight. I need, I need a 16. I could get it buttoned, but it would be really tight, and I would absolutely never wear it. I have a 36 inch waist, if that helps anybody out with their sizing. I could use a little bit of breathing room. There's no stretch at all. There's no elastic in any part of the band. You don't want it too tight with that pleating, because then it just ends up looking like mom pants in the bad way i don't know if it's that it's too small i would like i would like it to be higher too like they're supposed to be high waist but this waist isn't super high it kind of goes just over top of where my belly button is and i would like it to be about an inch higher you can see the pants are not super long i have these big heeled sandals on with them and they're not touching the ground at all so i could wear flats with them and the length would be fine and i'm 5'4 so i would say if you're tall these might even come off as like a cropped pant the material is very very thin so these would be nice for late spring summertime especially if you work in an office job like me and you always have a hard time finding work appropriate clothes to wear in the summer. I think the wide legs and the pockets are really cute. Honestly, I see where they were going with the construction. So these are really similar to the Doe and Hilaire pant, which are 100% cotton and definitely inspired by that 40s Palazzo pant kind of look. Like I said, I really love what they were going for, but the execution just doesn't work on my body. I could try the next size up and see if that doesn't agree with me a little bit more. I can also see these being really difficult to keep from looking hella wrinkled all the time. I don't know, I thought I was gonna be in love with these and I'm not in love with them. So The Gap also released these in a denim version. I think they're the same exact pants, just in like a blue denim. Overall, not obsessed with the Doen Gap collab pieces. Like I said, the midi dress was pretty cute. Um, the pants, I'm not so much a fan. So Doen, I'm not sure if it was worth compromising your values over this collab or not. 
I hope you made lots of money at least. If you got any pieces from the Doe and Gap collab, leave me a comment. Let me know what you think about them. And as always, thanks for watching.